Okay, uh, pardon my voice as these videos, I uh, kind of have a little frog in my throat. Um, before we start documenting our parts with uh, drawings, inventor drawings, we want to make sure that we have the part, the views of our part, the way we like it, so we're not surprised later when we have the drawing. One of the views we want is like an isometric view, and the, the view you'll get is when you click home, like right now I've clicked home right there. This is the view that I'm going to get for the isometric. Well, I don't really want that. So what I want to do is I want to move the part kind of into a position um, that I like for an isometric view. Um, I'm just kind of play around with it here. and Let's say... Uh, I'll go with that. So that's what I want for my symmetric view. So what I'm going to do is when I get it in that position, I'm going to come up, I'm going to right click on home, set current view as home, fixed distance. So that now, when I click home, that'll give me my isometric view. And so what I want is I want this side over here to be uh, the front, this to be the right, and then up here to be the top. So I'm going to click on, uh, let's see, I'll move it around. There, but right now it's called the left. So what I want to do is I want to right click again on the home, and I want to instead of set current view as home, I'm going to go to set current view um, as front. So I can do that. And so now when I turn to the right, it'll be what I want. If I go up the top, it'll be what I want. I can click on home, and everything will be um, uh, correct. So uh, that's what you kind of need to do before you start in on your drawings. You need to come in here and get your isometric and your front, uh, what you want to have show up in your drawing to make sure that that's all good.